All right, guys. For this one, we're just going to ignore all the mess over here on the counter, the empty beer bottles and stuff. But the perks of living alone is you don't really have to care about stuff like that. What I'm doing today is I'm going to make my own catfish bait. Jello and these really, these are cheaper than the Bar S hot dogs. Bar S is usually the cheapest ones you can get. These are a little cheaper than that. Uh, they're not even beef, chicken, and pork. Who wants that kind of hot dog? So, yeah. I mean, guess I should have made a little bit of an effort to clean up before I started doing this. Uh, I don't have any like Tupperware sealable bowls left, but I've got a Ziploc bag. That's what I'm going to put it in. Let me do this real quick. Should probably take a screenshot against my ugly countertop here. Yeah, that'll be the screenshot, and then I'll superimpose a fish over it or something that I catch. Uh, you know, this bag here is actually kind of squared on the bottom, so you can stand it up. I forgot to bring my knife, pocket knife in here, so I'm going to use a fillet knife. Why not? I'm going to cut open the package, dump the hot dog water into the bag. I'm going to use the hot dog water to mix the jello. Good for a knife. It's a cheap one from Walmart. Super sharp. Okay, there we go. A bag full of chopped up hot dogs. And some grape jello. Just dump the whole pack in there. And since the hot dog water out of the package is in there, I shouldn't need to add anything else. I shouldn't need to add any more water or anything like that. Just gonna zip it up. And they're turning purple. It's looking pretty good. I opened it up to let to squeeze the air out of it, and I just got a whiff of that, and you know what? That is not a good smell. No wonder it works as catfish bait. Like, grape Kool-Aid by itself, it smells good. Mixed with hot dogs, it does not smell good. All right, so I'm actually gonna let this sit out here for a couple of hours at least, maybe. Let them kind of absorb it. Uh, you know what, I'm gonna let it sit here for a day. I'm gonna come back tomorrow put it in the freezer and then in a couple days from now we'll go fishing I don't think he's on there anymore <laughs> yep Oh yeah, dude, that's a nice one.
big channel. <laughs> you swallow it? Damn. That's a big cat. <laughs> That's like the size they get in the river. Yeah. That's a quality fish right there. Yeah. Where is my line? I think you. No, that's not the hook. There it is. It's okay. Hook's right in the corner of the mouth. No, he swallowed it. No, he swallowed it. I hope I can get it out. Need pliers? Yeah, I can feel the hook right there. Okay. Well, he's not too far in. My. Here, I got it. Oh, you good? <laughs> ah, don't crush my hand. I ain't you go. See? Oh, it's right there. Mm-hmm. Or is it, is that your hook or is that it somebody like, else's it hook? It's like somebody else's hook. There's another hook in there. Yeah, I think it's a trouble one here. Damn. Go get some, mm -hmm. uh, get my pliers. Oh, where they at? Look. Yeah, there's a treble in there. Get that treble out fairly yeah, easily. Get, yeah, get that treble out first. Don't want to dig yeah. around in there with your... Somebody, uh, this is somebody's fish story right here. All right, treble's out. Treble's out right there. That wasn't too far down in there. I don't know why they didn't actually, get the treble out. Actually, you cut out my other hook. Did I? Yeah. You or did you, maybe I snapped the line. Yeah, I mean, yeah, when you did that. Oh, snapped your line. Yeah, the other hook's in here, so... <laughs> I don't want to throw him back with a hook in him still. But I mean, if you had to, he would. He'd... In some cases, it's better to leave this the hook in him. Should, you should measure him real quick. Yeah, let's get the get a scale. All right, let's get a good measure of him before I can put him back. Twenty-two inches, a little twenty-two and a half. Huh? Ooh. I ain't gonna go back. Don't worry. <laughs> Alright, well, a quick one before. You gonna get a weight on him or no? Uh, yeah, why not? He's a solid five, I think. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. Open your mouth. Good thing catfish aren't uh, very fragile fish. Yeah, he can breathe air. Oh! He's a strong fish, too. Hold him by the grips. <laughs> Just hold him real tight. Don't want him to get away with him. There's a hole. Four. Four oh seven. Here. Yeah. Yeah, I don't know somewhere my hook cut. Okay, that's not your weight either, is it? Yeah. No, that's my weight. Is that your weight? That's my weight. That's all mine. The treble hook looks like it's tight on your line. Nah, but it's tangled around it. <laughs> Uh, All right, well, well, here, you want to get him? Yeah. You got him? Yeah. Too bad, I was going to say get a picture, hey, but get uh, out of there. he's all dirty now. We got a video of it. He doesn't want to let go of my thing. Thank you. 407. Not bad. <laughs> Getting bites. But nothing's taking the hook. <laughs> Tell him I got one. Dude, it's a big ass sunfish. Uh, it's a big. Yeah, yeah, it's a big ass catfish. Yeah. <laughs> That's a big brim, though. About this picture. Yeah. Yeah, I just caught one. Hold up. <laughs> Wait. Wait. Send him a picture of it. How long you out there, It depends. Are you coming? I'll stay out here for as long as you're here.
Trying to get a... <laughs> and dude, this is this isn't the the green sunfish, the big one. This is just a bluegill. That's a good size bluegill, though. Yeah. I should have been more specific. I should have said a cat. You should have been. Oh well. Should have been. All right. <laughs> I had one, it snapped me off. I just had a big one snap me off. That was definitely a catfish. You got another bite? Yeah, he did. Well, it snapped me off, it's more than just a bite. You got one? I'm getting bites over there like crazy. This is a better one. Well, better than what I've been getting bites from. Oh, that's a nice one. I think my battery is dying. My light. Oh, that's a good cat. <laughs> my play <afraid of> like. <laughs> yeah, let me see. This might be better than the last one. Yeah. Ah, he slipped off. Open your mouth. He don't want to open his mouth. <laughs> there you go. He uh, slipped off, but I got him. That's a tank. <laughs> I don't know if he slipped off or snapped off. Turn your light off. There you go. Yeah. Woo. That That's one a, might be bigger than the last one. Get a measurement on him. Oh, that one's 20. 23. Probably it might be a little longer because you got the tape bent a little bit. 23 and a half. Yeah. Wait on him? Yeah. How much was the other one? Five? Four something. Four oh seven. He's a full pound heavier. Five oh eight. The other was four oh seven. Dang. Alright. Alright, give me my thing back. Give it back. No, <laughs> mine now. It's mine now. There you go. Cool. Okay, like five oh eight. Oh yeah. Thank you. <laughs> Not sure what my camera can see, but doing pretty good on the cats. Yeah, the other rod's good. Oh, come on, still be on, still be on there. Whoa, yeah, he's still on there. Okay. Pulling drag, see? There we go. It's not as good as Greg's, but it's a good one. <laughs> oh no, it's up there. It's a solid fish. And it's got some other line tangled on it. So. Come on, open your mouth.
camera can't see them too well, but I'll take a picture of them and put them up right now. Get them on the picnic table here. This one's only about maybe 20 inches. I'm not sure. Not a lot of light here right now, but <laughs> my bait works. Stop. Turn on my flashlight here. There we go. Camera can see them now. That's a good three pound, maybe 20 max inch catfish. Nothing compared to the two that Greg caught, but there we go. This one was on my bait. So now we know the bait works. Walk over here and release him. He's gone. Now I gotta wash my hands. Okay, so uh, I'm not sure if you can see this. There's a line right here in my hand. When I pulled in that catfish right now, this line was stuck to him. And I'm bringing it in, and oh, he just came off. There was this, there's another catfish that was on that line. Look, he's sitting right here. I'm gonna try to grab him. And it's not a bad catfish either. Look at this. It's another catfish. It's about. It's a little smaller than the one I just caught, but this is a solid catfish that was just on some random line that was laying on the ground. It looked like there was a stick stuck in the mud there, so it's like somebody's trot line or something. Ah, son of a... Come on this way. Ugh. Trying to lay him down. That's crazy. This is like the same size fish. Turn on my flashlight real quick. Look at that. It's almost the same size. This is, unless it's the same fish, I don't think it is though. Cause that line was stuck out there when I, when I picked him up, I saw the line. And that, it, yeah. So this is a different fish that was on a different line. that maybe somebody left out there and was going to come back and check it or they forgot it or something but I just saved this fish pretty much and then dropped him on the ground similar very similar sized fish that's crazy now let me, there we go. Now I'm gonna pick up that other line and throw that away. That's crazy. Okay, so I had just brought in that fish and it had the other line tangled up on it with another fish on it. And that fish had a big treble hook in its mouth. Now, if you remember earlier in the video, the first one that Greg caught also had a big treble hook in its mouth, but that one had been snapped off, so we thought maybe somebody, it just snapped off and got away from somebody. Uh, this one, it was tied to a stick that was stuck down in the mud, so I thought maybe it was somebody's trot line or something like that. It, like, they just threw out there and they were going to come back the next day and whatever. But, I mean, these ponds are strictly, strictly catch and release only. They, you're not allowed to keep them. You're not allowed to do that kind of fishing. Uh, so I released the fish. And then Greg had left. He had to go run some errands. And Drew got there. So when Drew got there, I went to meet him at the parking lot. And while I was going there, this guy on a bike rode up with some fishing rods and stuff. He asked me if I was having any luck. So I told him about the fish that I had just caught that was tangled up with another fish. And he's like, oh, yeah, that was mine. I, I, I do that. I catch them, and then I tie them off, and I like to play with them. You know, like what like I, I didn't know what the hell he was talking about what was going on he says he likes to play with them so whatever apparently what he does is he'll fish with like normal fish with the rod and reel and he'll catch a fish and bring it in and then he'll take that hook out of his mouth and put a treble hook in its mouth and tie it off to the bank and leave it there um, I, he says he likes to play with them like I guess they're his pets or something and he just leaves them in the pond tied to the bank and I don't know why the whole thing was weird and uh yeah so i mean that fish 
like I had, I released it. It was tangled in my line. I had to cut the line. It's gone. And uh, in this next part, he comes back to try to tell me about where all the fish are, and we find another one. I don't know. I haven't actually watched the video, so I'm not sure how clear it is uh, with another one. But he had a really big catfish uh, tied off somewhere else that he showed me. And then as soon as he left, I released that fish. Uh, because, like I said, this place was catch and release only. Uh, he did eventually come back to talk to us again and said if we wanted to, we could keep those fish. Which, no, we can't. But he did give me permission to take it. So releasing it was like me taking it. So no harm, no foul. Uh, uh, he just didn't know I'd done it yet. But he ended up giving me permission to do it. So uh, the whole thing was kind of weird, a little shady. And, uh, yeah, so... That's kind of an explanation about what's going on in this next clip. Uh, and then, yeah, let's get back to it. Yeah, he put on the, on the line. Oh. He put on the stick. Yeah, that one, he got tangled up on my line, so it came in. Not anymore. <laughs> he was, because he got all tangled up on mine, so I had to cut it. So, but. I got your uh, your weights. Okay. If you want those back. On this other end? Yeah. Oh, you know what? I saw the line on the Christmas tree. Yeah. Okay, yeah. I didn't. Yeah. Here you go, man. Yeah. I caught him this morning, dude. Is it still on there? I don't know. Do you still on there? There's line here. There we go. Yeah, there he is. He's big. He's pretty big. He's pretty. Uh, no? It's kind of... Don't feel anything pulling. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. He's on there. Yeah, he's still on there. He's pretty young, man. Check him out. He, the line bust. I think he'll bust that way. I don't fuck with you that much. He's pretty young, man. Yeah, he's my cat. He's pretty nice little my cat. Yeah. Yeah. I like to play around with him, but he's pretty big, bro. Yeah. Little youngster, man. <laughs> uh huh. He's pretty big, man. Hell yeah. He's a big motherfucker, man. That's bad, yeah. man. Yeah. Let me take pictures of him. Hold on. Right. You know what? I don't got a light from. I don't got a light, so you gotta put a light on him so I can yeah. see. Yeah. Yeah. Hold on. Let me let me take this off. All right. Yeah, I caught him earlier. Hold All on. right. Let's take a picture. All right. Hold on. Oh yeah, I'm ready now. <laughs> I think I hear my. Yeah. I got a bell on my rod over there. It's ringing. Okay. Thank you, man. So, all right. Let's see. Wow. They look pretty good when they go down there. <laughs> yeah. Wow, wow. That's, uh, that's not bad. That's about the size of the two I got. Hmm. Well, that's like the smallest one, though. <laughs> In the corner of the mouth. Perfect hook set. I can get it out. You gotta love it. You need some uh, pliers? Yeah, yeah. I got some right here. Oh, wait, oh. wait, did it come out? Yeah. Oh, there you go. All right. My bad kitty cat. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> you handsome bastard. <laughs> oh, oh yeah, everybody. Drew's here. Can't see him with his light, but. Yeah. Oh, hold on. Yeah. <laughs> there you go. Show my face. <laughs> no. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Hey, there you go. Be, be free, you fuck. <laughs> oh, oh, yeah. Fuck.